Hello. I hope you're doing well today. Today marks a milestone in my life. I have attained enlightenment. It happened this morning while I was listening to a book called The Power of Now by Eckhart Tolle. And it talks about surrendering or letting go of the past and of the future. That all we really have is now. Because the past is the past and the future is uncertain. So I listened to what he was saying. The book is done in a question and answer format. But from the moment I started listening to it, I understood what he meant. So I surrendered to the pain and suffering I've been feeling and I let it go. I let it all go. So all I have is the present moment and everything melts away. All my suffering, all the things I've been carrying for so long that I thought were part of me but they're not. All that pain I've been through, that's not what makes me special. That's not what makes anyone special. You have to find it from within. Relationships and the stresses of everyday life just melt away and amount to nothing when you're focused on the present. I can't stay that way all the time, but I did stay that way for at least an hour, and it was wonderful. I cried when that moment came because I've been searching my entire life for a way to let go. And it was so simple and so easy. I hope you go out and get that book or borrow it from the library either physically or electronically with the app called Libby. If you call the answer line or you call your local library, I'm in Toronto, so if you call the answer line, it's a special line where they have librarians who will talk to you and help you set it up on your device. And if you borrow it, or any of his other books, it's a very special, he's a very special man and his books are wonderful. Pardon me, the tears are flowing. That's okay. It's tears of happiness. It's not tears of sorrow. So otherwise, I thought of what I'd say. Sometimes people have asked me, why do you become an artist? Well, it was something that I always felt I wanted to be. There was no question about it. I started as a young child and I progressed 
and now I've been doing it for 52 years and I do it because I feel peace when I do it it's kind of like being enlightened being creative is wonderful all the sorrow you feel all your problems just kind of dissolve and you focus on the process of creativity not necessarily a result from weeks I got out my sketchbook and I just colored with my colored pencils I didn't want to have some sort of grand piece of art I just wanted to play and I think that when you're an adult play is important however you feel it I used to play with my dolls when I was little I collect them now but they don't mean that much to me anymore nothing really means that much anymore I guess that's what they mean by enlightenment everything just sort of falls away and you accept what is so if you have any questions um, just direct it towards me in the comments section and remember that you're special and you're important and that life is precious I commented on a lady named Froil. she has a YouTube channel called Froil Art F-R-O-Y-L-E-A-R-T and I told her about my life and sometimes that my mom is critical of me and she said don't worry about your mom she has her own issues just remember that every day is a gift and do your art knowing that it is a gift just be free so now I feel free yeah I feel free it doesn't mean that you know some things might get me down every now and then but when you've attained enlightenment you want to feel that all the time and I don't know anybody on the planet who could feel that all the time but sometimes I will I just get very still close my eyes and just breathe and it takes me to a place of peace so as I said if you like this channel if you like these videos please give it a like subscribe and don't forget to hit the little black button I mean the black bell sorry <laughs> A momentary lapse of reason um, and I will leave more information in the description next to the uh, drop-down arrow next to the title of the video I usually write a little bit about the video in there so everyone I hope you have a wonderful day and remember you're precious and that life is precious thank you very much bye bye